Hey vlog. Um, it is Thursday. Okay, I'm on my tippy toes because my camera's like on a makeshift tripod and I have to jump to be in the frame. But maybe we can make this work some other way. I feel like there should be, someone should make like a collection of images of YouTubers and in whatever, influencer makeshift tripods. I'm gonna take a picture without showing the mess that is my kitchen. Right now you're on an Air Max Apple box and then that's it. <laughs> You're, about, you're tilted up slightly by a uh, digital camera battery. Anywho, I'm very disheveled right now. I'm very scatterbrained. I'm giving you scatterbrained. <sighs> I couldn't tell you why. Actually, I can't tell you why. We're moving. We're moving like tomorrow. I haven't really packed at all. I don't have that much to pack. It's mainly just clothes. So we're going to do that today. I went to my favorite coffee shop. And I got two iced coffees. One for me. And two for me. And then I also got a croissant. Why I got two iced coffees for myself, you may ask? Well, a girl likes her caffeine. I have no coffee in this house. So I'm gonna show you guys what I've already done. These three are all Cell Depop boxes. I'm thinking of potentially bringing back the style bundle. What do we think? Um, I'm scared to because they are expensive. One, two, I have a lot more people tuning in nowadays whether it be on instagram on tiktok and i'm honestly scared of hate three i don't know i feel like people's expectations are a little higher nowadays maybe well those are my three negs and then my three positives are that i had so much fun doing it it was genuinely something i loved and like had no problem spending hours doing you guys really love them i didn't get too much negative feedback but obviously with everything you get negative and positive don't buy them if you can't like afford them obviously but like so much time and so much effort goes into style bundles but i'm thinking about doing them again because i have so much stuff and so much like really great pieces that i no longer wear or that doesn't fit me so i'm thinking of doing maybe like a trial like eight style bundles on my deep pot. let me know what you guys think if you guys like would be interested anyway that's where my head's at with all that depop stuff and then here's depop accessories that's also depop so you have a shit ton of depop stuff and then this is like office supplies and this box is candles and random shit i made a huge mistake i thought i was ordering big boxes i ended up ordering these tiny boxes so yeah go me because I'm really gonna miss this closet. This is probably the nicest closet I've ever had in New York. And unfortunately, I'm moving to an apartment that doesn't have a closet this big, and it's not this deep. It's very shallow. It's really sad, it's really sad. I'm not in love with the apartment we're moving into, but the market is really bad, and this is what I got. And I signed a lease, and I regret it, but it's okay. We're gonna make two. Being positive. I'm being positive. Heaven, comfort in your touch I'm taking all my hats off today Let my hair down cause I got done tonight I sat down, I'll pack my drinks and shoot these out Successfully, oh my god, successfully packed one box. I did like sweaters, um, long sleeves, yeah. Waking up so hard all in the morning, sun was leaving in on the coffee, body language, telling you something, all I want is you. about 
to leave. I'm gonna go to Devin's and we're gonna shoot some content. Letting sucks in my microwave. Need to apply some blush. This is the rare beauty blush. And then I'll be good to go. I always use my camera to check my makeup because like it really just shows everything. So like chill yourself before you wreck yourself. Hello everyone. So it has been a minute since I picked up this camera again. Or well, it's been a couple days. And basically this is the situation boxes on boxes on boxes um yeah so this is what i'm working on right now we actually had to stay in a hotel for a couple days because the apartment wasn't ready i don't know if this is focused but now i'm here i need to clean up i've been cleaning the closets um uh, they didn't clean it for us. There's a lot of things that I'm not loving about this place, but I am going to make the most of it. Just tip to everyone, don't settle. Cause I think I did. I think I could have found a lot better, but whatever, it's temporary. I'm young, it's okay. Um, yeah, and I'm gonna start putting away any clothes I can fit in the closets. I want to redo the whole closets because they're really poorly designed and I think the bar is going to break at any point and I'm just going to see how much I can get done and then sort for the floors if I can and yeah. I'm really thirsty and I need water though. Yeah, luckily it's a pretty cool night so I just have the windows open because I don't have any AC in here yet. Um, but yeah, this is going to be my first night sleeping at the new apartment. Ooh. from whole foods i got some water and like i honestly i went there and i really wanted fruit but it's like the end of the day and they were like completely out of fruit so i just got some water because we don't have any here um i'm going to try and get the bed finished now because i fear i might be too tired to do anything else so Let's do it. Probably shouldn't have just laid on it because it looks pretty dirty. And it's been in a storage unit. But here she is. I think she's from... This is the brand. Awake? No, that's not... Does, does not say awake. That says Awara. Um, they sent this to me a while ago, but it's very comfy. Highly recommend. Okay, now I have to make the bed. Yay! Before we grew up, before our problems blew up, we really need that hey, heads up, heads up. What would you say to your younger self? Life's like a paper plane, you don't steer the way. cuts and one on my leg and now 
can you see that arm i don't know moving is rough guys anywho don't have pillows and don't have a duvet cover so probably just sleep with this and like a sheet it's really hot so it doesn't really matter so this is the closet situation it's fucking bullshit um my hanger doesn't even like can't even sit normally because it's the bar is too close to the wall because they clearly didn't check. So I asked Luca to bring the screwdriver and the drill. So hopefully I can like move this more. But even then it's like the thing is just so fucking shallow that it's like I don't even know if it's going to work. Like his bar is farther out. But so like the hangers hang normally. But then the, like the doors don't close. Like, i thinking this might only be able to be, like... Oh my god, there's, like, a really scary wire. Like, this wire. I don't know what it is. But it's really scary. Anywho. Because, um, like, I don't know. You can't close this without crushing all your clothes. So, I don't know what this the solution is. It's very frustrating. And it's really fucking annoying. Like, I didn't know I had to bring hangers to check closets when you see an apartment. So, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Like, I literally don't even know if I can hang stuff in here. Ugh, I hate this. Hey vlog. So, I don't know if this is focused. So, I am in the new apartment. It's been... Oh, like it's almost a week since we've moved all of our stuff here. Um, very much not done. We have literally no furniture. Right now I'm using my handy dandy air fryer, which you can tell I really use because half the numbers are wiped off. This autofocus, it's trash. What is going on? Um... Anyway, I'm making some avocado toast. I feel like in the winter and fall, I was really like oatmeal, oatmeal, oatmeal. And now I'm really avocado toast, avocado toast, avocado toast. So I use this sourdough bread from Trader Joe's. It just like toasts really well. It's probably just sourdough in general. But I swear to God, toasting toast in the air fryer, life changing, life changing. Try it. I'll show you guys. I'll show you guys. And then I have my half of an avocado that I used the other half yesterday. Luckily, it's not browning because I'm weird and I don't like brown avocados. It's just not my thing. The, the apartment is growing on me. I know when I first like moved here, I was like, I hate this place. But it's growing on me. It really is. And we're going to make the most out of it. So right now, I have a bed frame I ordered. And I ordered a desk. And I ordered... That's it. Um, there's a couch I really want, but my debit card like has a limit on it and won't let me spend that much money all at once. So I'm trying to figure that out. But a couch I really want. But it's not going to get here for like six weeks. So that sucks. And I'm trying to figure out a dining table situation. But I don't want one too big. I want one like a kind of like a medium sized one. But all the ones I like are like huge. <laughs> But nobody cares about that. Um, I thought I would just film a little bits and bobs today. I've been very stressed out, honestly, because work is booming, which is amazing. I'm very grateful to have work, but I'm very stressed at the same time because I feel like a messy house is a messy mind. It's hard for me to like be motivated to like be creative and work and stuff when like my apartment is just like I don't even have anywhere to put clothes. I'm like digging through boxes to find the clothes I want. So it's very frustrating. My closet is just like not functional like I showed you guys. So yeah. I wanted to show you guys this little froggy I got. Um, he's from Urban and he carries my toothbrush. He's so cute. I'm wearing the new parade boxers. I got them, I should have got them in a small because I didn't realize how big they'd be, but they're so comfy. Oh my god. I was going to say I'm going to unbox these boxes while I wait for my toast, but my toast is now done. I mean, come on. I know this is a little toasty for some people. Um, I don't have plates, so 
don't judge me um i swear it's clean but like ow it's hot like bruh i like my toast toasted and the other side is like only a little toasted which i like but if you wanted both to be really toasty you just gotta like flip it halfway through um anyway fire All right, she's looking pretty good. We're gonna add some lemon and some salt and pepper, and that's it. She is yummy, and we're gonna eat her, and then we'll unbox those boxes that I got. Okay, I ate that avocado toast. It was incredible. I don't know, usually I don't feel good after eating like gluten, but I think sourdough is like pretty chill. I don't really know, but. I feel great after eating avocado juice. I feel energized. It's like 10.30. I got up really early. Um, I have a lot to do today. Big part of why I haven't been uploading recently is because I just like haven't had time with the moving and like all my work to edit. And I've been trying to edit my own videos, but realistically, I don't have enough time to do everything I want to do. And I think I've realized a problem of, with myself is I'm very like particular in how I like things done and I have a really hard time letting other people do things for me and getting help because like most of the time like it's not up to par with what I want and how I would do it myself so it's really difficult like for me to find people who like understand like what I want and like I don't know I have just like a really hard time like hiring people and things like that because like I feel like a lot of the time like people do things for me and then I'm like ugh I just wish I did it myself and yeah that's the problem I have. Anyway, this package is from Urban. I ordered... I ordered a bunch of home stuff because Urban is really great. And, like, reasonably affordable, cute home stuff. Because I feel like home stuff is, like, can be really expensive. This is ran really random, but this is an ice cube tray and box. Um, I use a lot of ice, especially in the summer. So, you get ice cubes. Put it like this, and then once they're ready to be popped into the box, you put them in the box, and then you have a nice cute box, and then you can just refill it. But oh, this is really random. I don't even remember buying this. This is a Golden Reed Diffuser Whiskey and Sequoia. I don't know if I like the smell of whiskey. I don't... No, it smells pretty good. I can like smell it through the box but i had these in our last one of these in our last apartment and it like actually made like a huge difference like it, it made the apartment smell good anywho and then i have a package from amazon this is all my recycling there's even more over here what i miss most about my old apartment is that there was a trash chute right beside our door anyway that's a big box from love shack fancy i'm going to the hamptons with them <clears throat> next weekend which i'm really excited about <laughs> all right what did i get okay first of all we got two pillows um yeah i love pillows we did have been sleeping with no pillows recently and it's been horrible it's been absolutely horrible um yeah that's my english accent So I'm super happy we have pillows. Now, low-key, I just like kind of bought like the ones with the best reviews. I'm just like, we needed something to tie us over because we have no pillows. But they feel pretty good, so that's good. Two. And this is, oh, wait, what? More pillows? This is, oh God, I probably accidentally bought four. I don't really know, man. I only bought two, but whatever. These are super plush gel fiber filled pillows. Okay, I was expecting a little bit more of an exciting package. Wait, these are, are these the same thing? Okay, whatever. Life could be worse. 
now I have four pillows. That's great. Well, I'm going to post like a lot of apartment updates on the ones on the floor on my Instagram. So make sure to follow that um, about new goodies I get and stuff. And I'll post like where it's from and things like that. Okay, I wanted to show you guys what I got. These are little shelves. Kind of look like that for the bathroom and they're supposed to work on tile but this is looking like a screw situation but i'm hoping to put them here because i have nowhere to hang like my face towel then i got these little wire shower caddies to put in the corner there for all this stuff i don't want anything on the tub so i want to put that there and then i guess i also bought this so i guess if this doesn't work I'll use this, but I don't really like the plastic look. It's from Umbra. I don't know how I keep buying two of the same th things. Like, I don't even know. Anyway, but this, I think... Oh, actually, it doesn't have... I thought it had a, a little rack for the towel, but it doesn't. So, fuck, I'll have to figure that out. And then, that, I got a little garbage. Ew, what's up? Um, I don't know. A um, little garbage from Muji. And then, yeah. And then in here is a clothing rack, which I'm going to use for the time being, just because I cannot live with my stuff in boxes anymore. I need to put some stuff out. And I also got this knife organizer and then this cutlery organizer. Everyone needs a junk drawer. Um, but I want to put, like, all the bags and tinfoil and shit like that in there once we put the shelves situation here it doesn't make a lot of sense right now but i'll let you guys see it when it happens and then it'll make sense i also got oh my god my face i also got this jewelry rack jewelry holder organizer i've actually never really had a jewelry organizer from this brand mel and co this came yesterday from diesel i don't really know i think it's cool though and um you can put like a flower in it this was gifted to me from for love and lemons no yes for love and lemons i think i'm gonna end the vlog here because i think it's pretty long already I will make more to come with more updates and furniture and whatnot. And check out my Instagram and my Depop. I'll see you guys soon. Love you.